butcher will be nearby. What are these goons hiding? I hear they took his arm at the butcher's order. I guess we are common thugs now, not soldiers. Shh! Keep your voice down. Kamoto, this is not what I joined the army for. It is what puts grain on your table. You are here now. When the butcher says jump, we jump. That is how it is. Now shut up before someone hears us. This is where they are hiding all the grain. Taken straight from the tables of Fayum families. Damn this greedy naked yadet. I should look around. Hey now! starving while the rich fill their storehouses. This has to stop. I should keep looking around. Ledger entries showing payments for grain. Huh. The butcher is not paying the farmers even enough to live. I need to find information on where he is. in the villa nearby. It is time this butcher and I had a talk. Villa, built on the backs of Fayum's farmers, no doubt.
Here's the Vlaka who's been messing with my business. We were just discussing you. You've been stealing grain from Fayum, starving people for profit. You're not from Fayum, are you? Your speech reeks of the countryside. That grain belongs on Egyptian tables. You naive backwater Malakia. I take orders from above. If not me, someone else will do this. This is business. People pay what they owe, or I take it. It's not personal. I'll give you a choice now. Leave me alone and live, or die here. Others thought the way that you do. Then they murdered my son. Everything is personal. You filthy Nekatiadet! It ends here. Guards, take care of this. One greet you. The Lord of the Duat awaits. What are you talking about? G -g -g Greeks and Egyptians have lost harmony with each other. The g -g corpse are displeased because of it. I'm Nanefer, and I don't know if I'm g -g 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 Greek or Egyptian. I'm an orphan. Lost harmony? What do you mean? The Egyptian g -g goddess Wajed is sending snakes into g -g Greek quarters at night. Only g -g Greeks have been killed. We are out of b -b -b balance. See for yourself. Just n n north of the villa. Okay. I will look into this cast. That was harder than it should have been. <clears throat> Neck. What was that? The gods are rumbling. It came from just north of here. Must have something to do with this curse. What happened here? I should ask around. This jar does not belong here. I think there is movement inside. Ah, I can smell the burnt flesh. Another foreigner cursed by Wajet. That is three this week. Those useless Greeks had it coming, if you ask me. But what do I know? I am just the lowly Egyptian caretaker who cleans up after the naked Yadit. Hey, be careful what you say. People have died. I need to look around. What you need to look at is the color of your skin, son. Harmony is what we need. Not more senseless judgment. Look, some of us have built a shrine in a cave under what is left of the great temple. Why don't you come and honor Wajet with us? Egyptians have to stick together. Maybe I will, after I look around.
jars are the same as the ones I saw in the Greek area. They are breeding the snakes here. Gods, I hate snakes. <laughs> ah, snakes again! Why did it have to be snakes? elaborate shrine to the serpent goddess Wadjet. Ah, what have I found here? Sound of it. I not have to find the caretaker after all. He has already found me. Caretaker! The snakes were yours! This is what Ptolemy has done to Egypt. A land out of balance, full of hatred and strife. At least I can rescue the hostage. Is being held by the caretaker's men at Panuki. The caretaker is using the goddess to kill Greeks. Why such hatred? Aya would be sad. It is just as Nanifer warned me his daughter. Egypt has lost harmony. That young woman is standing right on the edge of the cliff. I should check on her. Are you what are you doing stay back or I'll jump you aren't the first person to try and persuade me easy that is a long way down even for me 
It doesn't matter. Nothing matters anymore. The scorpion took my husband's life. There's nothing left for me now. You could find the scorpion that killed him and kill it. <laughs> Are you mocking me or trying to be cruel? Hey, even bitter laughter is better than death. Hey, why don't you step away from the ledge, huh? We can talk. I don't know what to say. Tell me of your husband. We used to come up here to watch the herons. Two of them built a nest together in that tree. We watched them bring fish for their young. We dreamed of our own children. And you are sad because you did not have any. You're not very good at this, Magi. You're not making me feel any better. There is no way to make you feel better. There is only tomorrow. And then the next day. One moment at a time. What you say is true. I just don't think I can face it. I want to show you something. I will return soon. Hey, try not to jump. There were some herons nearby, down by that tree. Caretaker's handiwork. These unfortunate Greeks were in the wrong place at the wrong time. <sighs> the caretaker's hideout must be up ahead. Abandoned us to the bastard Greeks. Well, at least he won't escape. You beat him so badly, he's like. Gifts from the caretaker to his men.
shrine to the snake goddess Wajet. Can you stand? Thank Serapis you're here. I d d d don't think so. They b b beat me. Be still. I will carry you out. They beat me because they thought I'm Greek. Wait. What happened to your stutter? I was scared when I first met you. It makes me stutter. By the gods, it's nothing true. Well, you are alive, Nanifa. Be thankful. I'm alive, but Egypt is out of balance. You must know, Magi, the law is harmony between all peoples. May Serapis unite us all. That is the end of the caretaker's cult. But Nanifer is right. Egypt is out of balance. And that is the order of ancients doing. I've got what I need. I should give the feather to the girl. Hmm. <laughs> 
careful. It's steep. Now you are worrying about heights? I've got something for you. <laughs> this is for you. A heron feather? Why? It is a sea one ritual. Feathers mean a lot to us. Anubis will weigh all our hearts when we die against Ma'at's white feather. Yours, mine, our loved ones. I know what you're doing. This feather is for my afterlife. Your husband will meet you in the field of reeds when it is time. But it is not a place to rush to. He would want you to live now and be happy. Yes, you're right. He would. I should thank you for this gift. You can thank me by showing me the way down. All right, Magi, you win. This way. I'm sorry. I must seem childish to you. Ah, believe me. No. I understand your grief. That's why...